everybody, it's me again. Welcome back to my channel. And for those of you who don't know, I'm Tina. Hi. Yes, today we are doing the purple palette. And I thought that would be a perfect time to pull out my purple wig, which I haven't worn since last year sometime. I believe it was during Halloween, Vlogoween. And so I thought, yeah, I'm doing the purple palette. It'd be fun to pull out the purple wig and put it on. So here we are wearing my purple wig and don't I look pretty? Yes, I do. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and do the makeup. I haven't done anything except for put the wig on. So I'm gonna shave my chinny chin chins. Yes, I am. And it's actually daytime for a change. It's 12.30 in the afternoon, so we actually have some good lighting going on. Okay, I'm going to put on some moisturizer. Because my skin has been feeling especially dry, especially on my face. And so we're going to need to hydrate it a lot. And I do plan on doing some more uh, other videos. And I don't plan on keeping the wig on for those. <laughs> it is just for this video alone. I thought it would be a fun little addition because I was going to be playing with the, the purple um, eyeshadow. I was like, let's pull it out and put it on. Why not? It is a pretty wig. I don't think it looks that good on me, per se, but <laughs> that's fine. It is it just in the fun of things. I do not think I look very good in purple hair. <laughs> it is a beautiful day today. It was really chilly this morning. I had to close the windows and shut off the air conditioners. Josie, she's still sleeping. It's 1230. She's still sleeping. Ryan, he's at his dad's house. He's in the process of moving all his stuff. Took a great big load of his stuff up to his dad yesterday. And he's staying there until Tuesday. Today's Monday. So... If he comes back to um, Tuesday or not, I don't know. The first day of his new job starts on the 27th, so. So I'm guessing he will be moving out maybe this weekend. I'm, I'm not exactly sure when his last day is at his, his job here. Yeah, if I, I need to go check my P.O. box. I haven't checked it in a while. And so if anybody has sent me anything, like if you mail me a, a present or if you mail me a letter to my P.O. box, you need to e either email me or, you know, put it in my comments to let me know to go check my P.O. box because I don't check it maybe once a month. And like I said, I have not checked it in a while. I have to go check it to see if there is anything in there. Be it a letter, be it a present. So if anybody has sent me anything and I haven't made any mention of it, it's because I haven't checked my P.O. box. Because <laughs> I can guarantee you it would have been in a video. Yes. Yes, it would have been. Okay. I really don't know when you're supposed to put this on. I'm just going to spray it on. I don't know if you're supposed to put it on before you put everything on or if you're supposed to put it on after you put everything on. I don't know. Okay, I think everything other than hmm, my highlighter. We're almost to the eyeshadow portion of the video. I'm looking for my highlighter. There it is. Yeah, I just used my Shop Miss A highlighter. Even though I have tons of highlighters that I've got. I got the um, highlighter palette from Amy. 
and I've gotten highlighters from um, Box Charm and Ipsy, Ipsy, and I just haven't put them into my makeup bag, so I don't use them. And I like my little compact one where I can just throw it in my makeup bag. Okay, now we can get into the purple eyeshadows. And somebody had told me in comments, and I have to tell you, but when I read it, I laughed. I don't know who said it, so I apologize. Somebody said, Tina, use your brushes. I watch your videos. I know you have <laughs> Okay, that just made me giggle out loud. I swear it because that was funny. So I grabbed <laughs> I grabbed my brushes. Now I don't know where um because in my last I think it was my box charm. This wig's making my head itch. I think it was my last box charm video. I had gotten some brushes that I kept, and I have no idea what I did with the stuff from that box charm video. The only thing I was able to find was the box that had the cream in it, which I think I put in the drawer behind me, but I believe there was a couple other things from that boxy charm that I had decided to keep, but what I did with them, I have no idea. <laughs> I will find them eventually. Now, I have no idea what brush goes for what, so I'm going to use this one. And as you all know, if you watched the video of when I first initially opened up this palette, I loved this color right here, so that's where I'm going to start. I'm going to start with that one and put that one right on my lid. With a brush. Now I am no diva when it comes to putting on eyeshadows. Is that the right word? A diva? A pro? No, I am not. I'm just putting it on to where I think it's dark enough. A little bit of fallout, but not too much. Okay, I think I'm going to go in with this um, really dark purple just to put a teeny smidge of it on that corner. Just a smidge. I'm going to go ahead and take this little one right here. Just to put in a little bit of that dark purple. And I'm just going to kind of just touch it on. Very gently. And I'm going to do the same on the other side. At least I'm going to try. Because that is a very dark purple. I don't want a lot. And I'll probably have to use a, a makeup wipe to uh, clean up my mess. <laughs> and then I have, I know this is a blending one, or at least it's close enough to be a blending brush. I'm going to kind of hold the brush to kind of blend it. To blend it in. No, I'm not a pro. This wig's getting in my way. And it feels like it's rolling up the back of my head. So I'll have to fix it in a moment. Are they somewhat? They look somewhat fine. Yeah, it's like fallout. I'll have to take a makeup wipe and fix that. My wig is sliding. Just kind of trying to fix it a little bit. Trying to anyways. This wig has a lot of hair. I bought it off of Wish. I think it was like $14. It looked a lot prettier on their model. <laughs> okay. I do have my makeup wipes out to clean up the fallout because I knew it would happen. Yes, I did. And I do have my mirror here, so I'm going to just pick my mirror up so I can get a closer see of what I'm doing. Doesn't look too bad. I 
I don't think it looked too bad at all. Not for me, anyways. <laughs> Definitely not for me. But we are going to go into a shimmery shimmer. We're going to go into this one right here. It's called Dream World. And I'm going to take uh, my makeup wipe and wipe this thing off. And it's also going to moisten it a little bit. So I'm just going to make sure I get that really dark purple off it. Plus it'll also moisten the, the brush itself. And then I'm going to go in here with some of that glitter. And that's going to kind of go right here. Like that. Isn't that pretty? So I'm going to wipe off that and then I'm going to just put a teensy bit of this really crushed, it's called crush, but that crushed glitter. I have it on the brush. I'm probably going to mess this up really bad. And I'm just going to kind of just touch it on here. Yeah, that's messing it up real bad. Well, we're just playing, so it don't matter. I was attempting to do it like a line here, but it turned into a big mess. <laughs> it turned into something I was not going for. Well, can I wipe that off? Oh, well, it took off some of the eyeshadow that I had on there as well, but that's fine. We're going to go back in and just put a, some of that dark purple back on there and just kind of make it a, more of a mess. <laughs> because that's what I do. Just to add a little bit more definition in that shadow corner that we go, go we this, yeah, 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 into that shadow that we want going on. And I'm thinking that looks a little bit better, but needs a little bit more in the crease. It's a good thing that. That I, I'm this is not my profession because <laughs> I would be fired. Yes, I would be. Okay, my eyes are like super glittered. I would have to say. So we're going to wipe this brush off again. Because I'm using it a lot. Yes. And I'm going to go into that dream world again. Which was the lighter. The more like the shimmery color. I'm going into that. And I'm putting that down on my lower lash. Carefully. And there, now we have a mess. We have a big old purpley mess <laughs> on my eyeballs. I can't really see much because you are a big old blur. <clears throat> so let's put on the eyeliner and the mascara because 
that will sometimes fix a mess. I'm hoping that will be the case this time. <laughs> I'm hoping what looks like a mess will become beautiful once I put the eyeliner and mascara on. So let's see what happens, shall we? Does it look a little better? <laughs> Does it look a little better now that it has eyeliner on it? And there be the other eyeball. So let's apply the mascara. And then we'll be almost done with the face. I'm just putting the mascara down on the table carefully so I could try to hold up this wig. Does it look better? Does it look better now that I put on the eyeliner and mascara? And of course, the face is not complete without the lipstick. Mm. Oh, and I forgot to mention, this is day five that I have not had a cigarette. Yes, I am proud of myself. It is getting easier now. The cravings have somewhat subsided, <laughs> subsided for me. So yeah, I still get them. I'm sure you have noticed that my videos have been few and far between this week. And that's mainly because when the crave, that's been, you know, cravings have hit and what I've done to try to, you know, to counteract them, I guess you would say. I've been taking naps, and so I did. I have had. I have no videos on my computer right now, so I just, you know, didn't have time to do videos because I've been sleeping, trying to stop myself from having a cigarette, and that's the main reason why I have um, the videos have been few and far between this week. But that will change come this week. The well, last week they're few and far between. This week, that'll change. You will start getting them more often again so now let's come and do the close-up of the eyeshadow look uh, it does it look beautiful you gotta be honest with me in the comments in the in the opinions yeah in your opinions did i do a good job and I, I mean, I was seriously trying. I wasn't, you know, just fooling around. I was seriously trying to come up with a good look. And I, I really can't tell because of trying to get a close-up, it's a blur for me. So I can't really tell. I'll be able to tell better once I'm editing it and how it looks. But I can't, you'll have to let me know. Yep, gotta do the sexy faces. Gotta do the sex faces for the camera. Yeah, we do. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe one of those sexy faces will be my thumbnail, depending, pen, <laughs> depending how and how it looks. But yeah, so that's it. So don't forget, like, comment, share, and subscribe. And here you'll see my little picture, so click on it. Click off if you haven't subscribed yet, because I post new videos almost every day. Jesse, until next time. Bye.